it's an interesting town. You kind of have the folks who moved here before the real estate crash uh, and the folks after the real estate crash. But I think the thing most of these folks have in common is that they all came mostly from the Bay Area uh, in search of more affordable housing and a smaller town quality of life. Perched north of the Tracy Triangle and about 20 miles west of Manteca, Mountain House is a growing community of about 27 to 28,000 residents. It's got 10,000 registered voters, and so far over 90% of those who have voted are in favor of the town becoming a new city. It would be the first California city to incorporate since 2011. Back in the 1990s when they were planning and creating this city, they always assumed that at some point the community would want full self-governance. Steve Pinkerton, the general manager of the Mountain House Community Services District, says it'll be the town officials' responsibility to carry out the voters' want for independent governance from the county. But this brings lots of new obligations. Well, with more independence becomes more responsibility. And I think there are some folks who, we've had lots of discussion, we've had dozens of community meetings, and I think the main concern that we heard from folks uh, is, was the fiscal analysis accurate? Do we have the funding to actually do all of this independent of the county? And are we ready to take on that additional responsibility? If the votes show residents do want that city status, and next month the San Joaquin Registrar of Voters certifies the election, on July 1st, those responsibilities will ramp up fast. But a mayor and four city council members are already committed, and the benefits for residents and businesses may serve as motivation. What does this mean to my bottom line, my pocketbook? What it means is, is that more of the property taxes you already pay come to Mountain House instead of the county. The sales taxes that you pay right now, 100% go to the county. Now those come to Mountain House. And any business growth in the future is retained by Mountain House as well. And in addition, uh, tr dollars for road maintenance and roads that now goes and can be spent countywide has to be focused here in Mountain House. Pinkerton says training sessions for the council elect will start upon certification and they'll have to put together all of the initial governmental ordinances. But he says he's looking forward to making sure Mountain House is ready to become a city if and when it's called upon. Reporting in Mountain House, covering local news that matters, I'm Zach Boweto, Fox 40 News.